Oh, okie doke. Oh no, getting getting a little better at fighting these things, but sometimes the odds are just a little overwhelming. <laughs> got to stay at range if you possibly can and they've done well with making the levels a little bit tight so you feel a little bit cramped for space here and there man I could do with another one of those tonics from Buccaneary right now what is this what are you little relic over there I'm gonna get that if I can blimey okay so I wonder if I need to bring a bring a bomb back in here and blow up one of these walls or something or maybe I can just get around it. Oh, this sounds like trouble, folks. Uh, let's find out, though. I, I reckon maybe we can go around to get it. Oh, gosh. What are these? I can grab these. Can I consume the water? Can I drink the water? So you can fire, fire water at things, I guess. Fair enough. I really want to be able to drink it, though. Oh, wow, they turned to stone. No way. Man, I couldn't have even called that before. Nice. Nice. Solid work. Oh, wow. What are you... Creepy plants, getting watered. Oh wow, it's unblocking that for us. That's cool. But we're leaving the owl relic behind, it looks like. Okay, I have to find out what's with the relic. I have to find out what's with the relic. I will... I will cut away while I experiment with that because I have a feeling it might take me a little while, but I will be back with you guys when I can figure out something that's going on with that. Okay, folks, I'm pretty certain that I can't get to that relic that I saw yet, and I keep calling it a relic. I don't actually know what it is, <laughs> but I don't think I can get to it just yet. I feel like I might be able to come back around to it another way. But what is going to happen here? I'm not sure. Oh, oh I'm, I'm glowing with an unearthly light. Uh, what is this? Gnomes, don't move a muscle. We must have stumbled into their lair. These things are seriously lethal, man. Listen, we have to get out of here. Gnomes may have poor eyesight, but they've got crazy hearing. They can hear you flapping your wings from miles away. Whatever you do, don't try to fly. Stay out of sight and climb your way out of here. If you get spotted, run for your life. Don't worry about me. Just remember to teleport me out of here when you get out. Please. Oh gosh, stealth section. Right, here we go. Not sure how these guys can... Not hear me... Jumping when they can still hear me flying, but... Oh, this is tense. <laughs> they don't look that dangerous, but... Appearances can be deceiving. <laughs> well, I flew a little bit there and it didn't seem to be that bad. Dun 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 dun. Oh dear. <laughs> Terrible eyesight. Excellent hearing. Right. <laughs> I think we can get around these things though. As long as we're not too impatient about this whole deal. Right. I'm not here. You didn't see me. <laughs> Just gotta stay very still. Uh, 
Ah! <laughs> I've no idea what these things are going to do if they hit me, but... I'm staying out of it. Ah, they've seen me! Oh no! Oh no! Oh. Oh, not good. Oh dear. Okay, so that's insta-kill. Fair enough. Just gotta jump. Keep jumping. Stay away. <laughs> the little walk they do is pretty funny. So we've got to stay away if we possibly can. And it looked like we had a lot more of this level to climb out of, so... Stay out of the light as much as we possibly can. And we should be okay. If our light bubbles intersect, then it's over. <laughs> the music is so menacing, I love it. Okay, so once this guy gets to the end of this platform, the other guy will have moved far enough away that we can probably jump up without triggering either of them. There we go. <laughs> Gosh, they're creepy. Alright, and if we jump over to this right hand side we should be good. Just gotta do it without flying. <laughs> oh, and you can move the camera around just a little bit so we can sort of see what's up here. Oh, oh, that was so tense. All right, all right. I think we're, I think we're gonna make it. I think we're gonna make it. Not sure where we have to go after this, but hoping this guy on the left won't see us if we jump up. He's got plenty of platform to work with, though, so he should be okay. Guy on the right's just got to turn around and make a hasty exit. I've just got to. Oh no! Just gotta hop down again. <laughs> that was so close! <laughs> I don't know why these things freak me out so much, but they are. <laughs> They're so freaky. So I've really got to jump onto this ledge on the right before I jump onto the one on the left, otherwise I need to flap my wings and they're all gonna see me. So I jump up here and I jump up here. And that guy starts running over, that's a problem. Oh! Oh! Oh gosh! They can all hear me flapping my wings, but... If I'm quick... Then I can make it. I wonder what's over here. Is there anything at all over there? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, <laughs> I don't care. I don't care at this point, I'm getting out of here. I'm getting the heck out of here, that is so creepy! Oh, we made it. Yeah, and he looks a little pale. <laughs> so, I guess we've got to get out of here. Oh, and we're, we're out. Oh, hello, you. Get out of here. Creepy flying eyeballs. That's it. We're done. We're done. I don't know how I could get to that coin. Oh, it's really irritating me because there was some explosive stuff around. I tried throwing it at the pillar every other way, but I couldn't. I couldn't open it. I couldn't open the thing up, so I have no idea what I was supposed to do there. Hopefully we'll get to replay some of these levels later? I don't know. I don't know how this is all supposed to work yet. And okay, so we've got to, we've got to platform our way through this bit. I guess we just get as high as we can and fall down. Yeah? Yeah, that works. That works. Okay. Oh, luckily he's got some decent platforming skills. Oh, and we fell. Okay. Decent platforming skills will apparently not be enough. So what do we got to do here? 
<laughs> He's not going to be able to shoot without us flying, apparently. Got to go up here then, do we? Is there something you need to stand on? I guess it is. Right, so we've got to... We've got to catch a, a bob bomb as it falls, then. And we have a little lid here that we can use to clog up this thing, so we don't need to worry about that. And then, yeah, you, just, you need to fall on there. And then the bomb is just going to fall down there in like a little cutscene. So there's not a whole lot we can do about that. Unless we take the lid off of this and maybe that does something for us. Okay, it pops out one of those. Fantastic. Do you reckon we can put the cloud underneath here? Is that going to cause the bomb to fall off somewhere different? Maybe that's what it'll do. Yay! There it is. It just falls onto the cloud. Nicely done. Very, very cool. All right, let's grab that. Huck it into this wall. Wapow! There we go. <laughs> A bit of an odd throw, but there you are. It happened. Let's grab this. Let's squish it into the... Oh, okay. We need to, we need to pop a lid on it. If you like it, then you should have popped a lid on it. <laughs> sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Right. Uh, pop that on there. Bring forth the totem of the owls! And goodness knows what that did. Ah, it's reinstate. Oh, it's it's moved the waterfall. It's actually stopped the waterfall. Fantastic. So we can head right back over here and fly our way through this gateway at the top. Awesome. Awesome source. Nom, 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 nom. I think we've had enough food, it looks like, which is good because, oh my days, it looks like there's a boss fight. I say, how does it look in there? Oh, it's them. It's them two guys. What do you think it looks like? Bah. The final impact snapped what was left of her in half. She's bleeding gears out of her side for crying out loud. What nonsense possessed the captain to have us fly through this death trap? Can it? We've got more important things to worry about, like how to get out of here. Where's that gawk pest gone to? Looks like she's carrying us out of here. Hmm. She won't be able to carry both of us. So what the heck do you want us to do? Flip a coin and... Hey! We've got company. A little owl. Why, hello, the kid is wearing an authentic owl cloak. We could use that thing to bust this joint. Hmm. Very well. It seems this is our last option. Sincere apologies, young sir. We will take that cloak off your hands now. No, you won't. Not if I have anything to do with it, except maybe they've got cannons going on right here. So... This is going to be tricky. Oh, what the heck? Oh, no. Oh, return fire! Return fire! Oh, dear. Oh, dear. He set me on fire. <laughs> Speaking of fire, how about that? Well, there's a rock up here that I could shoot, so... Maybe I've got to bring that rock down on the head? I'm not sure. Any of you... Quite the fight in this one. Have you prepared the turret? She's ready to go. Let's bring down that flying gold nugget. Uh, how about you don't? <laughs> I guess we use the turret against them then, do we? Yeah, that's what we do. Yeah, the turret is down again. Get out there. I guess we're just shooting this guy from a distance, huh? All this airborne combat is really difficult sometimes. That's right, get taken out. Uh, same again. Ouch! Okay, he fired two shots that time. That was not expected. Hey, hey! Loosening the rock for me, though. Nice. Get out. Yeah, yeah! Oh, we got you. We got you this time. Haha, <laughs> three shots ain't gonna do it, son. You're done. Oh, yes. 
Oh, I love it when a boss fight goes well the first time. Just gives me that tingly sense of satisfaction. Ah, the turret is totally busted. <laughs> we teleported out. I'd say we have been bested. At times like this, it is customary to admit defeat. No bloody chance. That's not the pirate way. I don't know where this guy's even from now. I would question whether we even follow the pirate way anymore. Captain Molstrom got us stuck here and is yet to return for us. Are we proudly part of his crew or just pawns in his ruthless plot? What? You dare stab at the captain with your prissy accusations? A real crew of pirates would never abandon each other. I would find deeper pride sailing the winds alone than with an unprincipled band of thugs. Why, you, you'll you pay for your treacherous words. I'll skew you right where you stand. Huh? Uh, <laughs> you about to get skewered, son. Boom! Oh, it's the, it's the trickster. <laughs> it's the, uh, did I just crash the party? <laughs> you? I thought we got rid, I mean, help me get out of here. You got it. H hey, wait just a minute. You're that troublemaker from Valley. Troublemaker, that was it. I was thinking trickster. And you're in league with the pirates? You distracted us during the attack on purpose, didn't you? Pirates? Attack? What are you babbling about? Dirk's my friend. I do what he tells me. You're just jealous because all you've got is Featherface over here. <laughs> Twig, enough squabble. Let's get out of here. Radio, Jump on and let's go. <laughs> so this guy's called Twig. Interesting. Oh. And they left their friend. Um. <laughs> well, I hope my musket did not leave too many scratches on you. You have remarkable resilience and put up an honorable fight. Please accept my apologies. We were desperate to get through these ruins, you understand, but that does not matter now. I hope we can part without any ill will. Good luck finding your way out of this place. <laughs> well, he's just opened up a tunnel for us, if nothing else. All right. Well, it looks like we are good to go, folks. Love me a successful boss fight. Like I said, I guess we're probably following him down this way. Oh, please tell me it leads to that chamber where the... No, I guess it didn't. Fair enough. <laughs> it was wishful thinking on my part. I want to get that coin. Oh, it's it's him again. He's standing on all the switches we need to open. <laughs> And running his way out. It looks like this is another one that's on a timer, maybe? But, no, we can we can squeeze through. I reckon we got the habit. All right. You going to help us with this one, friend? It looks like we're going to help him. Ow. Get out of here. And he's going to be like, yep. Oh, great work up there. My thanks. <laughs> I like it when when villains become, like, part of the group, you know? <laughs> I feel like he's probably going to join us at the end of this. Another predicament. This seems a bit much for either of us to handle. Perhaps it would be best if we could work together. There we go. There we go. The pirates will not want me back, and I'm free to do as I please. I, Alphonse, would be honoured to join your crew if you would accept me. Alphonse, welcome to the club. Well, you do seem more friendly than the other pirates and I have a feeling that that other guy wouldn't have attacked would have attacked us earlier if it weren't for you what do you think Otis I think yes <laughs> all right I guess we'll take our chances with you Alphonse just don't get too surprised when you get teleported around oh we got another party member mm, yes new stuff please and I wonder what these three are on the right hand side I've not seen anything happen there yet and the stuff next to the coins? Oh, I don't know. See, that coin. That coin in the middle there where it says zero. I wanted it. Alphonse, a gallant and friendly former pirate, loves theatre and poetry. That's nice. That's nice. This guy likes theatre and poetry. Alphonse's shotgun shoots a fire blast that burns trees and damages enemies. It needs to cool down after use. All right. So, interesting stuff. Whoopa! There he is. Oh, and apparently we can... Wow. Okay. <laughs> and it needs to recharge for quite a while. But main hopefully we can... <laughs> I love the little animation on that. That's so cool. Hopefully... Yeah, we need to get right up close and personal. It's like a, yeah, proper... Proper close-up shotgun type of deal. Boom! There it goes. That's so awesome. It really does need a bit of time to recharge, though. Look at that. 
Boom. Ah. <laughs> and taken down so easily just by a rock to the head. Well, it, it hurt me. It hurt you. So, <laughs> all right. Well, I guess we've got... Uh, we need to switch over, do we? Items. Alphonse. There we go. How do we... How do we do that? How do we switch between... Between guys? Okay, right. So we can switch using the... The left and right triggers. That's neat. Okay. Cool. So now we know. Now we know and now... We can... Blast this guy in the face. Thank you very much. <laughs> you thought you'd seen the last of me. I wonder if we can go back through the ruins the way we came. Because there's definitely a few puzzles back there that we could probably have... Maybe we can't. Maybe, maybe we need to come back in through the main entrance and do things that way. Or maybe we're going to go back through that way now. I'm not sure. Uh, I need to recharge. Excuse me, fellas. Die! That is dope. That is freaking awesome. I love it. All right, let's keep on moving. Alphonse, cocked and ready. Bam! All right, and let's uh, let's get some food while we're here. Sorry, Alphonse. <laughs> Just hold up a second there. I'm a hungry owl. Ah! I'm a hungry owl. I gotta eat. Boom! Right, let's let's get moving, shall we? Pucha! And take out the barrier while we're at it. Well played, Alphonse. I love this guy already. He's the best. <laughs> He's got a bit of a husky voice, though, so it's going to be a little bit difficult for me to keep doing the voice. I'm going to have to have another cup of tea in a minute just to keep up all of the voices for this series. I do like doing the voices, though. It's a bit of fun. Hope you guys are enjoying it so far. Ouch. Those guys got messed up. Right, that's going to open up that door. And we can teleport our way out of here. Like so. Whoop pow Nice. Good work. Get your gun ready, Alphonse. I sense trouble. <laughs> I sense food. Hold up here a second. Uh, I said there. <laughs> there we go. Nom, 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 nom. Man, I could do with some buccaneery tonic right now. Right, that's it for food. On we go. Shaboom! And we are back in the ruins at the spot where we came down before. Does that mean we can get ourselves... <laughs> that plant is having none of it. Fair enough. Uh, let's switch back to Getty to take out these guys from a distance. That's how we do. That's how we do. I love the fact that you can switch between these characters, though. It's pretty cool. <laughs> that guy did not stand a chance. All right. Uh, so, yeah, now we're back in this section of the ruins. We can lock and load, and we can deal with some of the challenges which have hitherto been inaccessible to us. That's one of the really cool things I love about video game design sometimes. And can you get us through here? <laughs> I just want to get to that thing. I don't know what it is, but I want it. Ow. <laughs> I tried. I really did try that time. Uh, let's switch back to Getty real fast. Just to deal with these guys. But the, the fact that you can you can go back through a level with different powers and you can find new ways of getting around stuff is one of my favourite things about level design in some video games. And this game, it seems like, is one of those. But like the Zelda dungeons are like that. They're ridiculously well constructed. Just because they have different ways of making you progress through the level. It's not just like, go down a series of corridors, you know? You revisit areas so often. Boom! You know what, I can grab this and this is going to make my life a little bit easier. Oh! <laughs> Did not realise a spin attack would get rid of it though. Alright, let's squish that. Haha, <laughs> turn you to stone. Nice. It's not as instant as the water from those pots, but it's... It's not bad. We can smash them into rock. Pretty good. Pretty good, I'd say. 
All right, we can get out that way. Fair enough. Fair enough. Right, I'm gonna have to, <laughs> gonna have to go around here and explore what on earth we can do to get me that coin. 